CapCut is probably the most popular editing app right now for TikTok and Instagram Reels. And today I'm gonna to show you two simple yet effective ways to spice up your videos by using the simple zoom effect within the CapCut app. And by the way, welcome to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Ken. My wife and I are travel content creators. We create content for brands and hotels all over the world. And here on this channel, we show you how we do it. So the first way to add the zoom effect to your videos is by simply using the built-in effects within the CapCut app. All right, so let's open up a project within the CapCut app. And we're gonna head down to the effects tab at the bottom, click on that, then video effects, then up at the top, scroll over to lens, and then we are gonna scroll down to zoom lens. CapCut is probably the most popular editing app right now. All right, there's two ways to adjust this. First, there's speed, that adjusts how quickly you zoom in, and then second, there's range, this will adjust how far you can zoom in. So let's play with the range. CapCut is probably the most popular editing app right now. And then we can hit the check mark in the right corner. This will place the effect here underneath your clip and then you can drag how long you want it to be. That is one way. Another way to access one of the built-in zoom effects is by clicking on the clip and then going down to animation. And we're gonna scroll over and they have a few zoom effects. There's zoom one, zoom two. There's also zoom in and zoom out. In the past, I have used the zoom out effect multiple times, so let's check that out. You have a slider down at the bottom where you can adjust the duration of the effect. So let's slide it all the way so that it lasts for the entire clip. CapCut is probably the most popular editing app right now for TikTok and Instagram Reels. There you go. So the built-in effects are a simple and easy way to add the zoom effect to your videos, but they lack flexibility. So if you want more control, then the second method is for you. And honestly, it's just as easy. So let's dive back into the app and tap on the clip. We are gonna click on this little diamond with the plus sign. That here is a keyframe. Keyframes are basically place markers that allow you to specify where you want an effect to start and where you want it to end. All right, so let's try to copy the built-in preset that we just used where we have it zooming out as it goes through the clip. So let's first start by adding a keyframe at the beginning with the arrow, or sorry, with the diamond. And now you can see there's a red diamond there at the beginning. We're gonna scroll over to the end, add another keyframe by hitting the diamond. Let's go back to the beginning. We are just gonna take the clip with our thumbs, zoom in, there we go. And now let's hit play. CapCut is probably the most popular editing app right now for TikTok and Instagram Reels. Boom, there you go. So now if we want to add something else different, let's do a keyframe in the middle, for example. Let's tap there, and then let's delete the keyframe at the end, and this will have the effect stop right here. Let's test that out. CapCut is probably the most popular editing app right now for TikTok and Instagram Reels. And there you go, you can see that the effect stopped at this ending marker, ending keyframe. So as you can see, the second method using keyframes is such an easy way to add the zoom effect and it gives you the flexibility that you want and need. And this is pretty much how I do it for all of our videos. And there you go. If you found this video helpful, then please hit the like button. And also, if you wanna see more videos like this and take your editing game to the next level, then hit the subscribe button right here so that you never miss a video. And until next time, peace.